Oh, I forgot my laptop. I can't read your comments. I'm gonna run and grab it. I don't even know where I put it. All right. Hey guys, welcome. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is maybe just a little introduction because I can't read your guys' comments. Talk about what today's going to look like and how to kind of navigate what's going to happen today. Um, and then I'm going to turn this off and I'm going to go grab my laptop. So we won't do this whole craft. I'll come back to finish this. Um, we'll mask it together. How about that in this? Because I cannot read your comments and I definitely want to have your comments today. So what is today going to look like? Oh, it's already starting off pretty iffy because I just got word that um, our deck and our landscaping are being done at the same exact time and they're getting in each other's way. And this is something that I have been afraid of because their timelines were kind of running into each other and I was like, eh, it's gonna be iffy. So I already started out the day, I felt great. And then I just got the call of like, which one of us can go first? And I was like, no guys, you're gonna go at the same time because we need this done. So anybody who lives in construction or does construction in their house or has flipped a home might understand my um, frustration, backstory on that. We've been flipping a home for not just this home. We have renovated homes for the last 14 years and I am moving on. I am ready to just kind of like enjoy my home and be done with that. So started off the day on real interesting foot, already trying to like whew, bring it down because I have decided this whole day is going to be me crafting with you guys just like we had planned. And also um, sharing and opening up about the saga of Sassy Tay. I literally was like, do I do this in a Western saga or do I do it in felt characters? Seeing as I don't have time to cut felt characters, I'm going to do it in a saga. So today I'm literally just gonna be walking you guys through the entire story of why where, how, who, why, I don't know. All the things of why Tay has such a hot mess express sometimes. And I'm just ready to not have to explain myself or feel like I can't talk about things because I feel like it's going to offend a company or offend a brand or offend something that could possibly get in the way of what I'm doing professionally. And I've decided I have worked too freaking hard to allow any company to dictate what I say on the internet. And I'm a very honest to a fault person and I'm not mean. So I'm really not afraid of anything I have to say because I have not, I, I can get very feisty and passionate and my feelings come out a lot but I'm genuinely always trying to think of the best for the companies I work with, for the influencers I work with, for the people I am serving on the internet, for my members, for everybody. Sometimes I forget to go, what do you need to do right now to stop this in its tracks so that we don't have to deal with it anymore? And today I'm like, I'm gonna talk about it. I'm going to open up and share and by the end of this, if you stick through the whole day and, and get to know a little bit more of the story, I hope you guys don't see me as a victim. I hope you guys don't see me as complaining because I am so, and I'll probably get emotional a lot today, but I am, I feel dumb pausing my whole life to stop about this. That's why I'm deciding to do it all in one day because I have such an amazing community and I have such an amazing staff team and I have such an amazing influencer group and I and watchers and viewers and usually YouTubers deal with drama in that realm with you guys, haters, all that stuff. I always get questions like, what do you do about the haters? And I'm like, honestly, my community is the most amazing people you're ever going to meet. And you guys have shown that to Tiffany, like you guys have welcomed her in with loving arms and 
she was terrified because she thought haters existed. And I'm like, not my world, girl, not my world. They do, but they're in the back end. So sometimes we talk about it on the back end. And I think it's getting to the point where a lot of people are like, you should really just talk about it and open up about it because it's getting a little out of hand. And I was like, yeah, it is. Um, so a lot of people know like the backstory and I'll go into it when I get my laptop so I can read your guys' comments. But I, um, and maybe it's a sign I'm not supposed to read comments today because it might just fear, fight me, fi whatever, fire me up. That's what it is. Um, we were talking about what characters we are and um, if we were to be a Disney character, what character would we be? And I'm like, Tinkerbell. I, I am little and sassy and fiery as heck. <laughs> so don't be mean because I'm gonna, I got you. Um, so anyways, with that, I will be sharing kind of like just the journey that a lot of you guys have been on with me. A lot of you guys have been here for a lot of this and have seen a lot of this and probably can piece a lot of this stuff together. If you really were to like watch every single video of mine, you could probably piece a lot of this together, but not everything. I'm gonna open up about why I actually got sick with epoxy, who um, led me into becoming sick with epoxy, why I don't carry glitter anymore, why products literally, when I say they sold out, like I get frustrated because it's like I have to then restock it before another company tries to jump in on that product that I put my blood, sweat, and tears into. So it's just, it's just a lot and it's gonna be a good day. We're gonna make so many fun crafts. And I was like, you know what? If, I, if there's any better time to talk about it, it's gonna be during Craft Your Stash because I'm literally gonna be painting and HTVing and all the things. So um, I only need to go grab my laptop for reels because I left it in the car. One, it's gonna be so hot today. And two, I don't want somebody to break in and steal my laptop. So I do need to go. This is part one, this is introduction. I can I can see my car, so I don't think anyone's gonna break into it right now. But, um, but I just kinda wanna introduce you what the day is gonna look like. I will name all the videos kind of what the topic that we're gonna talk about with the part that it is. So if you're like, I just wanna hear about epoxy or I just wanna hear about, um, I don't know. I, I've processed this with my team. I processed this with Dustin. I was like, when, what do I say? What don't I say? What, obviously I'm not gonna say anybody's names. Um, I'm not about that at all. And, but I am probably going to talk about like people in general, like, like the scenario and you guys again well a lot of you guys have already opened up about it and are like that's not nice they shouldn't do that so a lot of you guys are already seeing this um i'm just deciding i'm i'm gonna be a force to be reckoned with and i'm not just gonna stay silent anymore i've stayed silent for the last three years with 143 vinyl and i've stayed silent for i have not stayed silent on cricket you guys know that and honestly the tea with cricket is minuscule but it it just got real close to home the last couple weeks that i was like hold up gonna talk about this before it gets out of hand we're squashing this real quick so um but a lot of people are like you're you um you just need to get over it for yourself your peace of mind and i'm like you're right i do i really need to just move on i have bigger fish to fry and I have lots of things that I wanna do with my life and I don't have time to slow down and talk about drama. I've always tried to avoid the drama in the crafting world. I thought for sure like the crafting world doesn't have drama, so let's go that route. It's not the beauty industry. Um, and I slowly started to see a lot of drama as soon as I joined in to the Cricut community. I didn't see much before that because I didn't work with like brands or anything and instantly kind of started seeing a lot of drama. And I was like, whoa, 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 that's not my life. And so I don't really see a lot of drama with influencers anymore. And if I do, I'm like, peace out, don't have time for that. Um, so that, yeah. So anyways, with that, I have now since branching into products have experienced the business side of it and not just the influencer side and it ain't fun it ain't fun and it's not my cup of tea so we're going to talk about it but i have to see your guys comments because at any given time stephanie put up a red 
any emoji and I will stop talking because I was like, what can I say? What can't I say? And she's, she pretty much assured me like, these are your feelings and nobody can change that. And this is your personal story and this is what has happened to you. And then remember D so Dustin was just calling me like frantically. So I was like, did somebody die? But nobody died. It was just our construction at home is being held up for all these things. And that's when I get real mad. I'm like, I could handle drama all day, but get in the way of my timeline on my home construction. And I am a whole nother human being. <laughs> I was like, no, 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 not the time, not the time. So let's just talk about it. Okay, I'm gonna finish masking this off. Basically, I got this big old vintage frame for $15 at the thrift store and I spray painted it. It used to be like a gold. I spray painted it white and then I'm gonna chalkboard paint it. I originally was gonna take the glass out and do something on the backside of the glass and use the glass as a whiteboard. But one, it was super shiny and it's gonna be in the backdrop in there. And two, it is super like, stuck they like somebody i don't know how i i might be defacing a really awesome piece of something and i think it's i think it's a print though i don't think it's an actual painting so that would make me feel better but after i realized like it is in there like with styrofoam and glue and staples and backing and mounting i was like oh we're not gonna touch that we're just gonna we're just gonna do the front of it. So we're gonna chalkboard paint it and I'll be back. Um, this was part one, the introduction to the saga of Sassy Tay. Um, it, I don't even know if it's gonna be worth it by the end. You guys might be like, I wasted my whole life for that. But there are parts that I'm like, but we're gonna be crafting. So you don't wanna miss it. All right, I'll be right back. I gotta go grab my laptop so I can chatty chat with you um, and see you in part two.